the world's peace, and God's peace. Have you ever thought about soda and carbonated water? World's peace, God's peace, soda, carbonated water. The world's peace is like soda. It's delicious. It's, it's tasty. It's clever with its marketing. Sugary. Enticing. But at the end of the day, it's not good for you in the long run. It actually hurts you in the long run. Do you know they sometimes clean cars with it? Anyway, I'm just saying. It's soda. Soda's just not good for you. I mean, sure, it tastes great now, but in the long haul, long haul it's not going to do you any good. Hmm. But when you look at carbonated water, which is God's peace, carbonated water is pure, purer. It has more natural flavors in it. it it's clear. It's transparent. And not only that, it may not be the best thing since sliced bread when you're drinking it now. But in the long term, it's going to do you a whole lot better than soda. God's peace will do you a whole lot better. God is transparent. He, he loves you. He cares for you. He, he, he doesn't have fillers or, 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 or things you have to do in order to take his peace. World's peace, you got to jump through hoops. you got to have a lot of stuff you're not looking for in order to have that peace. God's peace, it's just straight up, <laughs> you chug it down. Think about that. He cares about you. He loves you. He's for you. He's not against you. Father God, I just thank you that this message hopefully just resonates and takes place inside of somebody as a seed to meet their need. God, the world gives us so much. And it, sometimes it tastes so good. And it's delectable to our flesh, but at the end of the day, it's doing our spirit no good. God, help us to focus on you. Help us to realize that you're the peace that we need and you're the peace that we seek. We ask all of this in your holy son, Jesus' name.